have your dumbbells eight into your base. You can have your mat out or just have it nearby when you're ready. We're going to go ahead and just kind of warm up here. Go ahead, nice, easy side step. Pull those arms back. Pull, pull. Good, just getting that blood flow in here real quick. Well, I'm glad you're here. We got strength going, maybe turn it into a hugger. Side to side. Coming to you live from my yoga studio today. We're going to do some strength training. Because why not? Because we can. It doesn't matter where you are, right? Maybe some shoulder rolls. Still side stepping in, shoulder rolls forward. Good, just some dynamic movement in that body. Body moving, and that blood flow. Good job. Kick the butt. Kick the butt. Kick. Give me some curls. Bicep curls. Kick and curl. Kick and curl. Good job. Squeeze the arms at the top. You got it. Good job. Take those arms up overhead. Pull down knee up. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. Curl and kick. One more time. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. Pull down knee up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good job. Back to those side steps. Maybe those arms strong, pushing back. Good job. All right, my friends, we're going to start to jump around a little bit. If jumping's not for you, remember you can always take the jump out. Let's jack it out. Nine, eight, seven. You can be right here and step it out. Six, five, four. If you have shoulder issues, keep the arms down. Two and one. Good job. Run in place. Run in place. Curl those arms. Get those legs going. Come on, run, run, run. Run, run, run it off. <laughs> Good job. If you're not a runner, you march. That's fine. Listen to your body. Run if you can. March if you have to. As long as you're moving through it, my friends. Come on. Four, three, two, jack it off. One more time. Seven, six, five. Three, two, and one. Good job. Run in place. Run or march. Get those arms going. Whatever you're doing, get those arms going. Come on. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good job. Shake it out. Grab your band. Grab your band. Your band is either handled or straight. The handle or straight bend. Okay? I'm going to take this guy underneath one foot or two, depending on how much tension you need. You're going to hinge forward and pull. Coming into a back row or a back pull. Hinge forward, belly in. Here we go. For eight, seven, squeeze at the top. Six, five, you got it. Four, three, two, Good job. Stand tall, bicep curls. Up and down. Good. Seven. Adjust your band if you need to. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Now, if you notice the band, maybe the band's a little light. Maybe you know you can go a little bit heavier now. Maybe you take both feet. We're going to do those two moves. Two more times. Here we go. Ready? Hinge forward and pull. Release. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and stand tall, bicep curls. Here we go. Ready? Eight, seven, six. If it deems too much, too much tension, you can always go back to one foot if you need to. Four more. Three, two, and one. Last time. Inch forward and pull. Release. Now, if you still need more here, you can crisscross that hand and pull. Release. Good. Five, four, three, two, and one. Beautiful job. Here we go. Bicep curls. Last time. Ready? Curl. Release. Good. Seven, six, Five. You got it. Four. Three. Two. And 
four, three, two, one, and done. Beautiful job. Set that band down and grab your dumbbells. Remember, you can sip your water anytime. Now we're gonna do those same moves, but now with dumbbells, okay? So you choose your weight, so we're gradually progressing, right? Gradually progressing, here we go. Back rows, nice and tall, hinge forward. Palms together, first round. Ready, pull, release, pull, release. Now, if standing and hinging forward is too much for you, you can come to a chair, absolutely. Hinge forward and pull like you're pulling up your pants. Three more, two more. Last one, good job. Stand tall, hammer curls. Curl, release, curl, release. Good, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Beautiful job. Round two, we're gonna change it up just a little bit. I want the palms facing forward. Hinge forward, palms forward, and pull. Elbows close to the side. Seven, here we go. Six, dumbbells go towards the belly button. Four, three, two, and one. Good job, stand tall, hammer curls. Eight, seven, you got it. Six, standing tall, five, four, three, two, and one, beautiful job. Adjust your weight if you need to. We're gonna go into those back rows one more time. This time, palms face back and we're gonna take those elbows out nice and wide. All right, so palms back, hinge forward and pull. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Beautiful job. Stand tall, hammer curls last time. Eight. Seven, six, five, squeeze in the top, four, three, two, and one and done. Beautiful job, set those weights down, safely out of the way, sip your water, and then you're gonna grab your circular band. All right, so I want you to think bow and arrows. Now you can use the straight band for this as well. You can use either one. Either one. Now you're gonna hold one side with one hand. You're gonna hold the other. So you're holding it right in the thumb. So think of it like a bow and arrow. Pull. So the elbow, get it comfortable where you're comfortable holding onto the band, all right? You might, if you have the handle band, you can keep the handle maybe in this band and pull on the band, okay? All right, here we go. Check that posture nice and tall. Shoulders down and pull. Here we go. Seven, yes, six, five, four, elbow up, three, two, and hold. Good job, nice and safely release, switch sides. Make sure the hands are comfortable on the band. You're out to the side with the arm, shoulders down, ready? Here we go, pull, seven, Six, five, you got it, four, three, two, and hold. Three, two, one, and release. Good job, shake it out a little bit. All right, we're gonna superset that this time with a bicep curl across the body. So with the circular band, palms face away from each other. One palm up, one palm down, yes? From here, you're gonna take your anchor point to the hip. So the bottom hand will come to the hip. That top hand is gonna curl up and across towards the shoulder. So it's just like an across the body curl, which we are gonna do with our dumbbells next. So across the body, six, five. Maybe you do a little bit lower, four depending on your band and tension. Three, two, and one. Now if you have a lot of tension, and maybe you're not getting as far, that's okay. If you're just barely moving right here, it's fine. We're getting that muscle engaged, it's okay. All right, here we go. Anchor point, other side, opposite side. Palms face away. Anchor point to the opposite side, across the body curls. Here we go. Seven, 
six, five. Keep the arm close to the body, five, four. Keep the wrist nice and straight, two, two, and one. Beautiful job, shake it out a little bit. Now, we're gonna do the same thing two more times, but I'm gonna show you how to use the straight band in case you don't have that circular band, okay? So, bow and arrow, bow and arrow, here we go, ready? Nice and tall, pull. Now, remember, you might need to adjust your tension to make it work your while, right? To where you get some of that tension that you need, okay? Good job. Three, two, and one. Switch, oh, hold, don't forget the hold. Almost forgot, but I remembered right in the last second. Good job, and release, other side. Now, if you have the handle band, you can hold the handle in the arm that's pulling, or you can hold it in the hand that's steady. Just depends on what's comfortable for you. Try both. All right, here we go. Bow and arrow, other side. Ready? Pull. Release. Pull. Six. Five. Four. You got it. Three. Two. And hold. Good job. Gently release. Now we're going to do those across the body curls. So with the circular band, you're able to kind of put the hands the way we need to, right, to get it where we want. Now you're just going to choke up on that band and use one portion of it that you need. Create the anchor point. That's the biggest thing with the bands. Create that anchor point and curl up and down across the body. Here we go. Seven. Six. Where there's a will, there's a way. Whatever you have for equipment will make it work. Five. Four. Three. Two and one. Good job. Switch sides, anchor point, other side. Now, if you have the handle band, you can have the handle in the top hand that's actually curling. And you're just holding the two of the band to the hip, okay? All right, here we go. Round two, other side. Eight, seven, six, five, four. Squeeze at the top. Adjust your band if ever you need to. Two. And one, beautiful job. All right, we're gonna do those two moves one more time. Bow and arrows. I'm gonna use my circular band. I'm gonna go back to the circular band. You can use whichever one you want. Here we go, ready, pull, release, pull, release. Good, six, five, shoulders down, four, three, two, other side, hold, and switch sides, other side. Almost forgot that hold again. Here we go. Ready? Pull, release, pull, release. Good. Six, five, four. You got it. Three, woo, two, hold, and release. Good job. We're going to do those across the body curls. Here we go. Ready? Last time. Find your anchor point and across the body. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, other side. Last time, here we go for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and done. Beautiful job. Set that band down, sip your water, and then grab your dumbbells. Can you guess what we're going to do next? Oh, it's gonna be fun. All right, grab those dumbbells. Actually, you only need one dumbbell to start. One dumbbell, you're gonna come into a lunge position. So one foot forward, one foot back. Coming into that lunge, you're gonna grab one dumbbell. Coming into our lawn mowers. Lawn mowers. Now, if it's too much to come into a lunge and utilize that leg, use a chair. It's quite all right, you can even sit in the chair and pull, okay? You got this, here we go, ready? Pull, release. Seven, six, five, four. Make sure that spine is nice and long. Two, and one. Beautiful job. Switch sides. Rotate those feet. Now, try not to dump too much weight into that front thigh. Utilize the core to keep you upright. It's just here for a little bit of stability, okay? All right, here we go. Ready? And pull. Release. Seven, you got it. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good job, nice and safely stand it up. Grab both dumbbells. <coughs> Across the body curls. All right, here we go. Nice and tall. Take it across the body. All the way across. So the pull is facing you. The palms are facing your body, and you take it across the body. Keep it nice and close. Nice and close to the body. You got it. I'll come a little bit closer so you can see. There 
you go, yes. Across the body, I'm gonna turn sideways so you can see. Across, all the way. Keep it as close to the body as you can. Four more. Three more. Two. And one, beautiful job. Set, uh, set one dumbbell down. Had to think about that for a second. All right, lawn mowers. Round two, here we go. Pull, release, pull, release, good. Six, five, four, three. You can also modify and come down to the knee. Last one, good job. Gently release, come on up, switch sides. Again, you can utilize that chair. All right, here we go. Eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, and one, and done. Good job. Round three. Nope, just kidding. Round two, across the body curls, finishing up round two. Jumping ahead. There goes Berta, jumping ahead. All right. Across the body curls. Here we go. Right there. Good. You got it. Keep the palm towards you. Good, keep those arms as close to the body as you can. Good job. Beautiful. Four more. Three, two, one and done. Beautiful job. All right, set one dumbbell down one more time. Lawn mowers. Here we go, come on down. Ready? And pull, release. Pull, release, good. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. Nice and safely switch slides. Last time, here we go. Get comfortable and pull, release, pull, release, good. Six, five, four, almost there. Three, Two and one. Beautiful job. Grab both dumbbells. Last time. Across the body curls. Here we go. Ready? Across the body. You got it. Good job. Squeeze the top all the way out to that shoulder. Almost there. Good. You got eight more. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and done. Beautiful job. Sit those weights down. Now, if you're using heavier weights, whew, you might not be able to go that fast. And that's okay. You take your time. Go ahead and sip your water. Sip your water. And then grab your band. Either one is fine. We're gonna finish off with a couple of back moves, okay? So either band is fine. Let me show you what we're gonna do. So from here, you're gonna hold on to that band or the circular band, either one is fine. You're gonna pull it apart and down towards the hips, squeezing the shoulder blades together. Now you might need a little more attention, so you just squeeze those hands in a little bit further, okay? All right, here we go, ready? Down and out for eight, seven, Six, five, you should have tension the whole time. Four, so when you come up here, don't loosey goosey, okay, keep tension, keep a little bit of tension. Three, two, now hold it down and pulse. So you're pushing those arms out to the side. Seven, six, four, three, two, and one. Good job, shake it out, shake it out. I'll show you with the circular band. You can do the same thing. Same thing, you may not open as wide, depending on the tension, but that's okay. Think about those shoulder blades squeezing together. Here we go, ready? Round two, down and out, and up. Now again, no loosey-goosey, make sure you have tension, that's your starting point. Good job, two, three, four, four more.
my long band, and I'm going to double it up and see how that feels. Right? You can always try. You never know. Unless you try. All right, here we go. Round three. Are we ready? Down and out for eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Woo! Two. And one. So that actually helped make it a little bit more challenging for me. So that's always an option as well, all right? Set that band down. Now, we're going to come down to the floor into a tabletop position, finishing with a uh, back, uh, back fly, okay? So come on down to a tabletop. Double up the mat under the knees if you need to. Only one dumbbell here. So again, tabletop position. Space between the knees and the feet here, okay? All right, here we go. Now, from here, nice and strong, straight arms, slight bend in the elbow. Seven, lower slow. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Beautiful job, other side. Here we go. For eight, seven, Six, stay strong in your table. Five, four, three, two, and one. Switch sides. You got this. Adjust your weight if you need to, okay? Here we go. For eight, seven, control the down. Six, five, don't let that dumbbell just fall down. Four, three, Two, other side. Woo! Oh, yes. You might feel this in the shoulder a little bit too. That's totally normal. Think about those shoulder blades squeezing together. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Other side. Last time, round three. Here we go for eight. Seven, six, five, woo, four, yes, three, two, and one. Other side, you got this. You got this. Finish strong. Here we go for eight, seven, six, five, four, One and done. Oh my goodness. Set that dumbbell down. Do a nice little child's pose for a moment. Beautiful job. Nice deep breaths. All right, my friends. Nice and gently. Come on up. Tuck those toes. Come back into a nice forward fold. And then roll it on up. All right. Are you ready? I got one more move for you. Grab those. Grab the bands. Preferably the handled band or the straight band. Oh man, woo, all right. I hope you're feeling this one. I know I am. All right, coming underneath the foot. Reverse curls, reverse curls. So palms face you and you pull up. Now, the goal here is to try to keep the wrist nice and straight, okay? So this might be a little bit easier with those handle bands if you have them. If not, these still work. You just gotta really focus on keeping those wrists nice and strong, okay? Reverse curls, here we go, six. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. Shake it out. We're going back to back here. Back to back. Shake it out. Adjust your band if you need to. Here we go. Ready? Round two. Reverse curl. Seven, six, five. You got it. Four, three, two, and and one, good job, shoulder rolls, relax. Adjust your band, couple of neck circles if you need it. Last round, ready? Three, two, one, and curl. Release, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, and done. Good job, set that band down. Last exercise with those dumbbells. Reverse curls. So this should be a nice little progression. All right. So palms face you, nice and tall. Shoulders down and back. 
Keep those wrists nice and strong. So what I don't want, I want you to bend the wrists, okay? Keep those wrists nice and strong. Here we go. For eight. Seven. You got it. Six. Good job. Gently release. Give yourself some huggers. Inhale. Arms 